Our offer this month is Moving Mountains by author John Elridge. And John, I'm going to quote from the book. I've been with a number of dear saints, praying saints, who rely on the famous expression, prayer moves the hand of God. They built a worldview around it, one of those popular religious sayings that has become sacred. Yet it is heinous, a heinous view of God. Later going to say it's heresy. Why, John? It is a terrible idea that God is not going to love you, intervene for you, do anything for you unless you beg him. I mean, you just became a grandpa, right? You can't wait to bless that little guy. He, you don't need to wait till he knows how to ask you the right things. You're already thinking about his life. I love that in the parable of the prodigal son. Okay, you remember the son's a long ways off when the father sees him. Now, how could the father see him while he was still a long ways off if the father was in the house? The father's out on the porch. He's looking for his son. He's the one that is longing for the relationship. Okay, so the, we don't want a view of God. We don't want a view of God where we have to beg him to intervene in our lives. That's not what prayer is about. It begins with a confidence that God loves you, that he's already at work. I've, I've really had to change this in my life. And I have to say now in the morning in my prayers, Father, thank you that you're already doing your best for me. So there's a difference, though, between perseverance, because we see that in the scripture. Absolutely. And begging. Yes. Big difference. Absolutely. It's the posture of the heart. Are you a son or are you an orphan? You see, the orphan feels a poverty, a, a, a desperation. The orphan has to beg. Folks, you're not orphans. You're sons and daughters. You get the privileges of the house. My sons can walk into my house and literally ask me for anything. And I want that to fill my heart, that expectation. My father's already been waiting. He's already been working on my behalf. That is really going to change my prayer life. Well, thank you, John. We so appreciate your partnership with Crossroads on this. And we want to get this great book into your hands with your best ministry gift, 1-800-265-3100. Or you can go online to crossroads.ca slash donate.